Hey folks, Samson here, and I wanted to showcase something that I found to be very helpful when it comes to bypassing HDCP. If you clicked on this video, you probably already know what HDCP is, and you're wondering how to bypass it, just like I did. So my setup that I have here is the Xbox Series X and the Elgato HD60S Plus capture card. I like to do things I'm probably not supposed to by streaming movies, TV shows, what have you, with friends online. And you can't do that with the Elgato capture card. It just doesn't allow you to do it. You cannot use copyrighted material through the Elgato capture card. Well, I found a way around it thanks to some research on the internet. And it's as simple as this little bad boy here. Just a two-way HDMI splitter by REI, I believe. HD 102. That's the splitter. It's this little, little doohickey, which is back there. I got it off Amazon, $15, $20 and all, like with shipping. Not bad at all. Not really bad for what I'm trying to do. And it, it works flawlessly. Even in the description of the item on Amazon, it says HDCP compatible, meaning it, <laughs> it shouldn't be doing what it's doing, which is bypassing it, but it does. And I'll show you guys live that it does indeed work. So right now the Xbox is just plugged into the Elgato capture card. I have Godzilla vs. Kong 4, 4K disc, because that's my entire life. I've been a Godzilla nerd since always, just a little, bit of, a little bit about me there. So when you put in the disc, and then we pan over to the TV so that we can see what happens. So you click play, it's just plugged into the Elgato capture card, and three, Two, one, zero. Uh, there we go. It says, uh, screw you guys, can't do it because HDCP rights and all that jargon. Well, that's annoying. That kind of sucks. Um, so, if I go back to the main menu, and I, well, first you got to quit the app before you try to do the HDMI splitter. So now, I'm going to take my Xbox and plug it straight into the HDMI splitter and then plug the HDMI splitter into the Elgato capture card. Get this thing all situated all purdy. It ain't really situated purdy, but that don't matter none. No reason for that. Now that I've done that, we'll pan back over. I'm going to click play once more. And now it's connected through the HDMI splitter and then to the capture card. And look at that. It's it's loading. It's working. The disc is going to play. The movie will happen. It is absolutely working. I will skip all the way to the main menu just to show you guys that it does indeed do what it says it's going to do. It's not going to just load the menu and not actually play the movie. Okay, any day now. Cool. Same selection, just random scene in the movie. It, it plays and you have audio you have video you have all of it it, it doesn't do anything incorrectly it's not like it's not going to actually play what you're trying to showcase and it works for multiple different platforms it works for streaming services and it works for actual discs so it's not just a disc only kind of thing it can work because i've done it i've, I've rented movies through my xbox and done it it works so yeah folks it's as simple as that. That is my setup for the Elgato, yeah, Elgato capture card and the Xbox Series X. HDMI splitter, I'm gonna put it in the description below. I hope this helps you guys out like it helped me by learning about this. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. This is Samson saying, sayonara.